I'm Ruth Babcock from Carolyn Originals and Events. And today you're going to take the Toss Bouquet and each one of you has to throw it into the silver urn before you can move on. If you don't make it, you gotta keep going back and getting it yourself until the next person gets to go. Okay, let's Fantastic. get started. <laughs> it's gonna be challenging. Yes. Yeah. Just a little bit harder. Good. Oh my gosh! <laughs> that was fantastic! Get it a little shorter. You got it. Come on. You got a little more power on it. It's light. It's light. Switch hands. Okay. Yes, good job. Okay. Two hands straight back. Two hands straight back. There you go. Good. There it is. Oh, yay! <gasps> so one hand? Should I do one hand? <laughs> yes. Just like your. Hey! Woo! Done! Oh, that was really close. Baby, just rip it off of there. Okay. Yes! Good job. Fun. Yay! I'm glad you have practiced with the accuracy. Yeah. That way we can pick which one of our relatives we want to get married next. <laughs> yeah, that's true. It's hard to balance, you know. Yeah, the my heart. heart's like racing. He says I can't catch or throw, so it was a challenge for me. You did a great job, and here is your next clue. Twirl your way next to 121 Clay Avenue. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Good Thank luck. Thanks. All right. <laughs> it's locked again. Why do they keep locking us? Welcome to Arthur Murray. My name is Aaron Jones and I'm going to explain the rules of today's competition to you all. You're going to be given a sheet with a description of four different dances. You will have 30 seconds to study the sheet. At the end of the 30 seconds, we're going to take the sheet away. Then my dance partner Amber and I are going to perform the four dances, but we're going to perform them out of order. Once we finish performing all four dances, we're going to give you a separate sheet of paper and it's going to be up to you to write down the correct order of the dances that we did. As soon as you're finished, we'll take the sheet and we'll determine if you correctly placed the dances in the right order. If you did, then your time will be entered into the record. If not, we'll do it all over again. I appreciate you. Okay. <laughs> I got it. Okay, no pressure, but you know, I got a little bit of my pressure. Side. Passion, elegant, wish, wish pendulum. I'll be able to tell when I see another one. I'll stand up. You know, it definitely looks like oh, swing. Swing, yeah. Like something some old people would do or something. <laughs> <laughs> no, the other one's lots. Because this one's not. That's a lot of hips, so make sure that's wrong. No, we're just guessing ourselves now. I think the first one was wrong, because the guy exaggerated his hips. He's not moving his hips now. Go. Oh. No, no. There you go. Okay. Hockstar. Rumba. Waltz. That is correct. And that is correct. Swing, fox, trot, done. Uh, yeah, that's correct. This is just a really fun day. Yeah. We were saying earlier in the car that it's like a series of mini dates. Yeah, and this, uh, wow. The dancing here, incredible. Yeah, that's really That's fun. nothing like how I dance. <laughs> so I said it was fox trot the first one, she said, uh, the rumba because he was moving his hips so much as they were dancing. So I went with what she said because, you know, I would rather lose this. 
get her upset at me if I was wrong to say to begin with and she was right. <laughs> well, I've taken a little bit of ballroom dancing lessons before um, with, with them actually, or this company. And so that was a little bit helpful. Yeah, very helpful, because that was no help at all. <laughs> Congratulations on completing the assignment. Here is your next clue. All right. Everything has a place and every place has a thing. If an item is misplaced, it could affect your race. Lex Effect, Park Place, 120 East Main Street. Let's, Let's go! go. Hey guys, I'm Jen here at Evans Orchard. We're standing here in a renovated tobacco barn in our event space. You guys know past the orange, we're gonna play past the apple. One player from each team will pick up an apple on this side, pass it with their partner, and drop it in the basket on the other side. No hands. We have 15 apples here. You only have to do 10. But if you drop one on the ground, I'll move one around. So if it hits the ground, that apple's disqualified. The team that gets 10 apples in the basket in the shortest amount of time wins. Ow. On your mark. Get set, go! Go, 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 get! There you go. Okay. Yeah. Drop one, drop it. Okay, oh, drop two, go. Well, I have it. Drop it, drop it, go, go. Drop it, yeah. You got it? No. Yeah. Stick down, stick down. Control, control in the... Controlled chaos, for sure. <laughs> that was one of the more difficult ones, I think, don't you? Yeah, it's uh, incredibly hard to carry an apple with your neck. <laughs> yeah. With the hug motion, see, see right here, see this there hug motion right there? That's the handoff right there. You gotta love each other. <laughs> That's the handoff key. We went from high to low, I don't think, I think it would've been harder if don't tell the other couples that, but like going from his height to my height, I think that was a good decision. It's been a blast, you know, we've had many challenges and many uh, unique situations that we've not been in before and it's been very uh, rewarding and very enriching experience, so. Definitely feel like we did our best today. I don't feel, have any regrets or feel like we should have changed anything. We definitely no. pushed ourselves. I, you know, to the other couples, I wish the best of luck, but uh, this wedding's ours, so, you know, keep that in mind, <laughs> right? Watch, watch facts. <laughs> uh, there's some uh, competitive juices that go, but that's 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 a fun part of it. So, um, and it's just a super cool experience. I mm -hmm. think that we are super thankful to get to participate in this. Absolutely, and uh, good memories. Absolutely, great day. <laughs>